All right. I've been promising this a long time. Season mode playthrough. Here comes the pain. Hit the like button. Share this video. Subscribe to this channel. Let's start a brand new season. Uh, no, I don't even know what's carrying over. I don't remember doing season in here. Carry the stable over. Whatever that is. We're just going to keep the roster how they are. I believe Piper's on here, so let's add him. He was there then. Now, let's see. Keep the rosters how they are. For this, now for this season mode, I didn't want to be someone who's so dominant like The Rock or Brock Lesnar. Goldberg is too easy. But also, someone like Rodney Mack, it might be too difficult because their ratings are so low. It might be a struggle to really build them. So I wanted to get someone who's kind of middle of the pack and someone who should have got pushed harder. Steiner would be too dominant. Sean O'Hare, he's a good prospect. He has a good moveset, but might be very difficult. Shawn Michaels, he's like middle of the pack. Shawn Benjamin, I don't really like his moveset. Austin's dominant. Steve Richards, Stevie Richards, I think he's the lowest rated player. Cruiserweights like Tajiri, Rey Mysterio. It's very difficult for them to beat bigger wrestlers like it should be. Um, I think this was the first game that had like the weight detection where Cruiserweights couldn't just slam Giants. Maybe No Mercy had it first. I'm not sure. Uh, but I do like Test. I think Test might be who I go with. He's kind of middle of the pack, sort of. Too dominant. You know, uh, Big Show, he's an 81, but he's, he's too dominant. His strength is, is too much. Booker T, he's kind of middle of the pack, but I don't want to be Booker T. No way. I don't want to be a tag wrestler. Uh, Benoit, Jericho, eh. Christian, he's already a champion. He would be a good pick, but he's already a champion. I, I want to start where you have to like build to a belt and build. Um, Goldust, too fruity. Hurricane, too goofy. Cena, sellout. Kane, balding. <laughs> Kevin Nash, might tear, might tear a quad in this video. Angle is already the champion. Lance Storm, boring. Matt Hardy, delete. Um, Rhino. Now that Rhino, he, this is another good pick here. Rhino. I don't, but I don't, I don't like his move set in the game that much. And even the gore. If you miss the gore, if, if you play this game, the gore is so easy to reverse. If it takes so long to get his finisher up, and then if you miss that, it's gonna be hell. Um. Van Dam's a good prospect too, but he's already a champion, you know, and and I don't want to start in the hardcore division. So I think for this, we're going to go with Test. All right. Here we go. There is one question people always ask me. Why do you wrestle? I ask myself the same question every morning, feeling the pain, but I do it for so many reasons. The rush of the rush of adrenaline, the roar of the crowd, the glory of a championship, but I know there is more to it. Who the hell is that? Maybe I'm doing this to find an answer. Maybe when I get to the top of this squared circle, I'll find, I'll find out something about myself. It's moving too fast. But I guess... I'll step into the ring, into that ring again tonight, okay? Because I know the view from in there is unbelievable. All right, that's great. All right, here we go. Uh, I believe this, yeah, I believe I'm on Raw. WrestleMania, the night after WrestleMania, JR's rambling. All right, the dust has not settled just yet. That main event was awesome. I think the fans had trouble sleeping last night. Then we should have then then we should apologize ahead of time. You might have trouble sleeping tonight as well. All right. All right, Jim. All right. The classic raw theme. Oh, Eric Bischoff. Test and this damn baby blue. Hey, Test. As you probably know, I'm the GM of Raw. Breaking news. As the GM, I have a certain duty to provide the best quality show to the fans. But you're a smart guy, so I don't need to explain this to you. Don't let the pressure get to you, and welcome to Monday Night Raw. All right, Bischoff. I'm testing this damn baby blue. All right, here we go. Week one, on the road to main event status. 
All right, let's see what we got here. Now, a big part of this is going to be getting his rating up. Starting at a 74, strength is a 9. His best attribute, his weakest attribute, submission and speed is a tech technique to counter 7.5 endurance 7. He's a, he has a solid rating. Um how quickly you can get to a 80, 90. Is it possible to get to a 100? I don't know. Might take a long time. Uh, let's see what we have here. I assume we don't have any money. Yeah, no money to start out with. Uh, uh, you know, this I don't really care for so much about this stuff, like unlocking your tires. Uh, this is more about the journey of building someone to the main event, you know. Um, I don't believe Tess is in a stable or a faction. Let's see. I don't believe so. Evolution, 50,000 evolutions. Okay, let's see. Okay, so we're not in a stable. Sean O'Hare and Piper. Who knows, if, if Raw goes wrong, we might have to go, jump to SmackDown, but you know, maybe, maybe like, we'll see maybe six months in, what have you. Um, I believe, does this have superstar rankings? Okay, I have 68 points. Okay, got the record, win loss record, okay. Who you face, okay. Alright. So we'll see what we get from here. Actually, let me see that. Uh time info. Okay. Now I the goal is right here, the world title, but at a seventy four you're not gonna be able to get that anytime soon. And I don't I really don't want to do hardcore title. Could probably dominate that. But the goal is Intercontinental Champion for at least the beginning. All right. So let's, uh, you can talk to various superstars backstage. Let's go to this. No one's back there. Maybe you can get, a, can you get a title shot week one? Let's see. Get an Intercontinental title shot. What do you want? Title shot. So you want a title shot, huh? These are the titles you can challenge for. World tag and hardcore. No, no, I don't want the hardcore. No, I don't want the hardcore. What? But this is your big chance. Well, okay, is there anything else I can do? No. I don't. Okay, it had an option of do not compete. I hope that doesn't mean there's no match this week. I just don't want the hardcore title. Might have to settle for that. Okay, so we're not booked the first week. Oh my god, Goldberg's about to destroy Christian. Goldust versus Batista. Batista wins. Goldust is already jobbing. The first job. Can Christian hold on to his belt? <laughs> yeah, right. Great. Now Goldberg. Okay, maybe we don't want an Intercontinental title no more. <laughs> maybe we should have took the hardcore title. All right. So the first Raw is in the books. And we were not booked for the show. So uh, week two. Phoenix, Arizona. Make sure you hit that like button. Stay tuned to this series. Share this with whoever. Tell them to get over to this channel. A limo has just pulled up, folks. I wonder who's inside. Must be those centerfold models coming to pick me up. The king is a pervert. Something about him and a llama and mean gene. That's on my other channel. Anyway. All right. Oh, man. Are we going to get booked for this show? Damn, not booked for week two. But the title's on the line again. Can the Dudleys retain against Evolution? So Triple H can get two titles in this. The Dudleys retain, okay. Stacy Keebler versus Victoria. Victoria wins. And Evolution's in the main event. Great, it's Evolution show versus Booker T and Gold does. And Evolution lost his whole night. All right. I wonder uh, who's the number one contender. Okay, McMahon just pulled up. Him and Janelle Grant. She's wiping her mouth. Good, good Lord. It's Mr. Vincent Kennedy McMahon to you. The man who owns the whole industry. Mr. Vincent Kennedy McMahon. Okay. What's he doing here tonight? How are all... How are you all doing tonight? Good, I hope. Actually, you should all be grateful. Grateful you have something to do tonight in this piece of crap town. Anyway, let's cut to the chase, damn it. Test. <laughs> He's calling out Test. You're a great talent. 
So he does have some intelligence. You're not like these other low-life scum in this town. You actually have a future in life. <laughs> McMahon's future is in a cell as I record this. But don't get too cocky. There's so many inside jokes here. Remember, all WWE superstars are my property. Good lord, what type of plantation slave owner? Whether you'll be in the next WrestleMania main event next year or not is all up to me. So, so don't forget that. That is all. All right, he's already planning to see for WrestleMania a year later. You better not cross the boss. All right, so two weeks in, we're not booked. Can we get on the show? Can we get on heat? Houston, Texas. Houston, Texas. Maybe we run into Booker T. Let's see. Maybe we can run into Booker T. Nah, 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 nah. You know what? Might have to just accept that hardcore title. Are we booked? Damn. Oh, great. Kane's hardcore title for Kane. RVD beats Kane. Okay. Okay, I think the next week I'm going to have to go in and get that hardcore title. We're just going to have to start there. Evolution beats the Hurricane up. That's a fair match. And look at this monster main event. Austin Goldberg Booker T versus Rock, Triple H, and Jericho. And Rock, Triple H, and Jericho win. All right. All right, we're headed to Backlash, I believe. Yeah, I, I got to get on this show. I, I got to get on this show here. I got to get on this damn show. Th this can't happen. Three weeks in, no matches. No, I got to get on this show. Oh, Chris Jericho. Okay. You can meet Y2J. Hey, jackass. I've got something to say to you. What the hell is that? I've got something to say to you, too. I'm busy right now. I got something to say to you, too. What? <laughs> Why don't you shut the hell up? On second thought, I don't want to talk to a complete 100% grade A ass club. <laughs> so hit the bricks, Junior. Pissed. I don't give a damn if I pissed him off. I was hoping, I was hoping a brawl broke out. Give a damn about Jericho. All right, Bischoff, I need that title shot again. I want a title shot. Yeah, let's get that hardcore title. All right. And I'm sure you're going to make it an exciting match, right? Sure am. If this isn't a great match, then you might not get one of these title shots again. All right, let's go. Thanks for dropping by. All right. It's about that time. Rob Van Dam. It's time to take Van Dam out. Wait, can we? Is, all right. I thought he might be backstage. All right. We got a hardcore title shot. Rob, first match. All right. If you win this match, win the title and get 500 SmackDown dollars. Okay. And he's paying like, um, who's a cheap? He's paying like Paul Heyman in 97. Matt Hardy. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. First match, title match, title shot. Okay. All right. Let, let Scott Steiner. He can have uh, Stacey Keebler. He, he can have her. Let's get to this business. We're at a 74. Van Dam is an 81. And beat him all around this damn arena. All right. It's interesting. Van Dam has his like 01 theme song. All right, let's go. Let's just get to it. Okay, reversals. Got those down. Here we go. Oh, he has a, oh, he has a finisher already. Damn. He already has a finisher, so he has the advantage. Get him up out of here quickly. Neck breaker. There we go. Okay. 
Dirty Earl Hebner. Tess is Canadian, so uh, gotta watch out for Hebner. There we go. Let's get to him quickly. Let's get to him quickly. Overpower him. Keep him off that top rope. There we go. Here we go. Here we go. Hopefully nobody runs in. Nobody should. There we go. Come on, Tess. Got you in this honky tonk man, baby blue. Pump handle. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Might get him right here. Might get him right here. Might get him right here. Come on, Hebner, you bald spot bastard. Oh my god. About to strangle Earl Hebner. He deserves it, but. Alright, here we go. Man, this might be record time. Pump handle drop. There we go. Pump handle slap. Oh, I reversed it. Alright, reverse that. Can I fool Nelson? Oh, I wanted to fool Nelson slam. Choke slam. Choke slam. Alright. Scott Hall choke slam, damn it. Oh my god. There we go. Come on. There we go. There we go. There we go. I don't I don't want to miss with that big blue. I'm about to hit him with the overdrive. Oh my god. No, 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 no. There shouldn't be rope break in this match, so it should be okay. If I hit him right here. Come on, Van. Oh! Damn, damn. Oh, get up, get up, get up. Overdrive, overdrive. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Yes! Hardcore champion, hardcore champion. Come on, Hebner. Come on, Hebner, you bastard. Two. Count faster. Oh, my. Earl Hebner. Earl Hebner. He would do this with a Canadian in the ring. Okay, get up, get up, get up, boy. Get up, boy. Come on, Van Dam, get up. Big boot, big boot. Oh. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Uh, there we go. Hardcore champion. Come on, ref. Come on, get to it. Come on. There we go. Hardcore champion test. The first episode captured a title already. Didn't want to start this way, but they weren't booking. They were not going to book uh, Tess on the show. So got to get on here any way possible. I didn't want that tag title. There we go. Test. Hardcore champion. There we go. Now let's see. $500 richer. $500 richer. But um, did it also give any points? Because he got to get this rating up. Van Dam, that was kind of easy work. Even though he had a finisher. Um, okay. Goldberg and Booker T versus Rock and Kane. Okay, Rock and Kane win. Odd tag team. Shawn Michaels, Triple H. Okay. All right, Triple H wins. All right. So we got 16 experience points. We lost one point because the Jericho encounter and then got two. So pretty much st stuck at, it canceled each other out, basically. So I guess that's where we're going to end this first episode. This is uh, episode one. Uh, stay tuned for this series. It will be uploaded very, uh, very uh, frequently. And that is it.